Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, if you hear me whispering, it's because it's like 6.30 in the morning. Um, today is Monday, April 6th. Um, if you're wondering why I'm up this early, it's because I'm actually getting ready today because for my 8 a.m. legal writing class, I have an argument, an oral argument. So um, I will be doing oral arguments via Zoom, but I still have to look presentable. Like I still have to wear my suit jacket and you know look better than this. So I just thought I would bring you guys along with me as I'm getting ready and then bring you along with me for the rest of my day because Mondays are my busier days of the week. So um, it's just another day in my life, but today is a little bit, today has a little bit of a twist just because I have oral arguments. So you'll get to see how I look for that and then kind of how I'm preparing for it. And I want to read over my papers and stuff like that and just be a little bit more prepared for when it turns 8 o'clock. through my hair just so it looks a little bit more put together but my makeup is done I just need to curl my lashes and my hair is done but I need to change into my suit but I won't do that until it gets a little bit closer to the time that I need to present uh, so right now I'm gonna go to my living room and practice um, what I'm going to be saying and just go over my folder one more time <music> So I've changed into my blazer. I'm just wearing this white blouse. Um, and then of course, my black blazer. I'm not gonna show you the bottom half because I'm just wearing leggings. It's literally just like my everyday leggings. Um, but again, it's only gonna be showing the top half of me. So it's not like I, it's not like it matters when I'm wearing like for bottoms. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna be wearing this. So this is kind of the angle that the professor will be getting and this is what he'll be seeing. If you're curious to see what it looks like, here you go. Um, I do have it buttoned and I usually would have this tucked in to my slacks, but again, I'm just wearing leggings right now, not really slacks, so um, he won't be able to see like from here down. So as you can see, I've changed. Um, I changed out of my blazer and that other blouse just into a t-shirt and then wearing some leggings because why do I want to be dressed up while I'm home? Um, but the oral argument went okay. I could have definitely prepared more for it and done more to prepare. But for it being my first time, I think it went pretty well. Um, I answered the questions. I did run out of time, so I think I did good. I think I did speak a little too fast, but I think that'll, you know, get better with practice. So right now I'm just cleaning up a little bit, just tidying up the place. Um, I have civil procedure in like 20 minutes, so I'm about to get ready for that, like bring out my book and stuff. Um, but I'm also going to just hang out for a little bit, maybe make a cup of coffee, and I'll probably drink that while I'm in civil procedure. So I've really been into chai lattes. Um, I've always liked them, but I go through phases where I really crave them. Right now, to avoid going out and getting one, I bought this one, and then the almond milk. They only had this brand. I usually get the almond breeze one or silk. But Target didn't have any other than this one, so I got this one, which is just fine. But I always get the vanilla unsweetened, and then you'll want to get this one. And what I do is I just put it in my milk frother, and then I mix them both together in there. I froth them, and then I pour them over ice in a cup. I don't have a cute cup, so I just use a regular glass. So let me show you really quick. had them before so I know exactly what they taste yeah taste amazing every time I make them they taste different but they do taste just like the Starbucks ones or like your local coffee shop it tastes just like that so if you have a milk frother or if they sell one of those like sticks that froth milk 
I would definitely recommend you guys getting one because you can make any type of latte with just a frother and especially chai lattes you just gotta mix the milk and the tea and you get this so I 100% recommend you guys get one it tastes amazing here is my little station this is what my day-to-day -day zoom looks like so I just have my laptop rested on some books so it could be a little bit higher and like even out with my face and then I'll have the notebooks I don't have it right now but I'll have the notebook where I'm taking my notes I'll have some sort of caffeine so today I have a chai latte I usually have coffee and then I'll have the textbook that we use for the class so this is just literally what my setup looks like when I'm done with my first class I'm gonna start cleaning um, I have to clean my whole apartment especially with all this like stuff going on I want to make sure my apartment's extra clean so I'll be doing that right after civil procedure So I just got done with my first um, lecture for the day other than my oral argument. Um, I just had civil procedure and I'm about to make some breakfast. I think I'm just going to have avocado toast. I love having that. I haven't had any breakfast. I've only had my chai latte. So I think I'm going to go do that now. And there's my dog just <laughs> laying around. Uh, but I'm going to go do that and then I'm going to try to start um, doing some schoolwork. In between my classes so today I have crim law at 1 30 so I have a few hours before I have to get on to zoom and do my lecture again I'll probably do some readings as I'm eating and then I'll start cleaning after all my classes for the day are done so here's my avocado toast so I only use half of an avocado I use the everything but the bagel seasoning and then I do add a little bit of salt and then some crushed red chili peppers just to add, like add some spice. I kind of put too much this time but it's fine. Uh, but yeah, this is what it looks like. I don't like adding lemon to mine. I just don't like the lemon and the avocado together. But this is my breakfast. just got done with my criminal law class so now I'm just kind of like picking up stuff that's where it doesn't belong kind of like this and then um, as you saw I cut up some bananas because I forgot to buy frozen ones so I cut those up to put them in the freezer so I can use them for smoothies so um, I'm just gonna keep cleaning up I have a phone call at 345 um, so I'm gonna just clean up until then and then after that, I do want to work out. Um, I bought a lot of workout guides from different sources, so I want to try one of them out today for sure. So I'll be doing that and letting you know how I like it. So in my last vlog, I had mentioned that I got an internship, um, which is still very true. Um, I accepted an internship for the month of July, um, and it's going to be a four-week internship. But I just got some really great news right now. Um, I actually secured a second internship, so I'll be doing one for June and another one for July. The June one is going to be a paid internship, which is great. It's kind of hard to find a paid internship your first year, unless you're like top 10 or anything like that. So I'm really excited, I'm really blessed. Um, I'm really thankful for having that opportunity to get a paid internship. So I just wanted to share the news with you guys because I had told you all that I was interviewing and I was doing all these things for internships so I just wanted to tell you guys that it does pay off to interview and to you know take it serious but yeah so I have two internships coming up one in like I said the beginning of summer and one in July of course everything is still up in the air because of the whole corona thing so depending on that is if they'll still happen or not but as of right now they are set to happen so I'm very very excited but I wanted to share that with you guys so I'm currently making some Spanish rice and then I have some chicken in the air fryer. So I have that going. And then we're gonna have some of these. 